Shane Melanson. I'm a commercial real estate developer, investor, and uh, consultant. When I started working with Matthew in the one-on-one -on -one capacity, I was shocked because <laughs> he was really able to articulate my value proposition better than I could after one, uh, maybe two hours. Matthew kind of helped me get clear on the path, right? In terms of like, here's what it looks like. Here's what it looks like today. Here's some milestones. Here's where I think you can get to in the future. And then based on that, here's kind of like what we need to do, you know, step one, step two, step three, step four. Right. And so, um, without having that context, it was like, it was very easy for me to stay busy, but I wasn't necessarily busy on the right things. You get frustrated, overwhelmed, and then you end up quitting. Uh, right. And, and I think that that's probably, uh, a reality that, um, you know, I've experienced in the past and, and some people might be able to relate to. The first time I, I said that, you know, I was the arbitrage architect uh, to my wife or, or uh, family members and whatnot, that's not how they uh, saw Shane. When I went back to Matthew, he's like, well, they're not your clients and they know you as Shane Melance and the commercial real estate investor, right? So when you put a different label on yourself, um, it's to be expected. So just having someone that, that has kind of been there and seen that type of, uh, whether you call it feedback or just kind of, you know, some of the, the obstacles that come up um, as uh, uh, when you're going through the process, uh, that was very helpful. One of the last things that, that I did with Matthew was really refine my sales process. And it was funny because I had, I'd been through a lot of uh, uh, sales training in the past and when he and I started to role play it within the first 15 seconds, just the way that I opened, um, I was going down the wrong path. And so that, that, that's, those are the type of things that you can only get from someone that has that kind of experience. When I was with Matthew and you have four or five calls and that doesn't go the way you want. And then all of a sudden you make those changes and then the next two go exactly the way that you want. I mean, that's a, you know, that's a, a 10 or $20,000 difference just from, just from small, small changes. One of the key things that I took away when working with Matthew was like getting really clear on who it is that I help and how I help them. Frankly, I didn't realize it at the time, but you know, I've got about 30% of the people that I've helped in the past that were in the medical field, whether they were active or passive investors. My uh, tendency was to go as broad and Matthew was like, well, no, let's, let's kind of really hone in on the messaging because the, the messaging to say a physician is different than an entrepreneur. I just needed someone, someone, you know, like Matthew's outside perspective to shine a flashlight on it. I'm in the process right now of uh, negotiating uh, a pretty significant deal, basically in partnership with a gentleman that has access to a database of several thousand you know, eye doctors and dentists and physicians across Canada. And, uh, and he and I are now um, working together on a project. None of this would have happened had I not got the podcast, wrote my book, you know, really got clear on, on that core messaging because he would like ask me about some of the posts that I was making on Facebook or some of the, you know, podcasts that I was going on. And he really helped me get clear on like, are you telling the story of Dan, the physician that you helped, right? Because that, that story will translate into, you know, all of the people that you want to attract into your, into your world, if you will, right? And certainly I had financial expectations, which we exceeded. And, and, you know, I was able to go from one to one to group in a very short amount of time. Definitely in the first three months, I was able to recoup that investment. And then it's just kind of continually grown since then. I think I started at $3,000 for one-on-one -on -one, um, uh, clients. Now I'm up to kind of five figures. I've essentially, um, you know, tripled my prices or more. And I've been able to get back having that kind of permission and then really understanding that it was, um, it was pretty incredible. I tell, you know, numerous people if they're serious and they want to get into, um, you know, growing their own business or practice, uh, that Matthew is is the person that I would um, put at the top of the list to to have those conversations with.